Hello everybody. It's a commute tonight. I've not been on the channel for a while, which I've got good reason for. I'll explain in a second. Um, it's been a bit of a bit of an odd time. We've had a bit of a bereavement in the family. Unfortunately, we've lost first son, Sonny, and he passed away last Sunday. Um, he was 14 and a quarter. We've had dogs for over 14 years and it's very odd, very odd. What a sad do. We are mixed emotions, obviously. We don't want him suffering, we didn't want him getting old and decrepit. He didn't. He had a little bit of arthritis, it was getting worse, but he was alright. And he had a fit quite suddenly on Sunday and uh, we're gutted. It's quite a lot of emotions tinged with, if I'm honest, a bit of relief as well. Because we didn't want him hanging on and suffering too much. I don't want to put my feet down here. I, d I just want to do a little bit of, a bit of this. So yeah, it's a sad, sad do. We are a little bit upset, but understandably, that's part of having a dog, isn't it? And having a dog that you're devoted to. And that's the thing. Now this is what's going to be interesting with the channel moving forward. We've been restricted on what we could and couldn't do and that's got more prevalent, that issue, this last couple of years since we moved. Because we wanted to make sure that we were looking after him and not leaving him too long. If we went out for a ride, so we were restricting ourselves. We, we couldn't really go out for long periods because we wanted to, you know, make sure he was okay. And, not be people that leave him when we go out to work and then leave him on an evening as well and on weekends. He was a big part of the life, of our life, but we did say that once we've planned for this to some extent, you don't plan for the emotional side, but you plan for the practical side afterwards and the practical side is in fact quite exciting, especially for the channel and we're going to be able to do a lot more you know, uh, fun and games with it because we can go out for days on end, we can go camping, we can do what we want. I can do a little bit of commuting and I don't have to stress, I don't have to worry about getting home fast for my dog. I can just bimble around, I can go out for a morning before I go to work and do all sorts. I can really enjoy life going forward once we get over the upset of losing him already booked a bit of time away which we've not been able to do for some time because like I said we wanted to be devoted to the dog and giving him a good life and we did that so what's happening going forward future plans and this is the big thing we're hoping to have a bit of a change of direction or some additional stuff we're going to be doing on the channel and that's what's really good for us. We are very much looking forward to doing a little bit of travel blogging, if you like. We're going to be taking the bikes in the future, sometimes for rides from home to destinations. We're going to be doing reviews on places we're staying. We'll possibly ride from home. We've also got the option to ride from the destinations as well because we've got the trailer and we're going to take the trailer and the bikes far afield and ride from there we might go to the Flinders we might go into state there's so many options for us now which is fantastic and we're going to be doing a little bit of a review on various places as we go forward and including as I said destinations, meals out where we're going to, the actual 
rides we'll be showing, where we're going, having some fun and games on the motorbikes and it's a lot of it's going to be adventure riding in the fact that we'll be off the beaten track and I'm looking forward to doing that in and amongst some of the basic stuff we've already done so exciting times I hope that's uh, cleared up a little bit of why we've not done anything for a month and generally a little bit more regular with the content but understandably we had the wind took out of our sails a little bit and we're just adjusting to life as a twosome now we started as a two we became a four we lost one dog seven years ago then we lost the other one seven years later so we've had a long time with dogs so we're now back to a twosome and actually if i'm honest enjoying it as much as we can do and i'm going to enjoy the freedom which is fantastic who said these T7s weren't a good commuter? They are bloody awesome. I can get through this traffic, no problem. It's quite easy to thread one. Anyway, that's us. We'll see you soon, very soon, as the channel evolves quite quickly from now on. It's going to be awesome. Better concentrate on getting myself home in one piece tonight. I think it's nearly wine o'clock.